Hi, I'm John Colley, and today we're going to talk about taking a printed product and cutting it out with Job Control Vision on the Speedy 400. On screen here in Corel Draw, we've brought up our file that shows uh, the print layer, the cut lines, as well as the registration marks. For sending it to the laser, we don't need to send the print section. That's already been printed on the page, so all that's important to us for the as far as the laser is concerned are the registration marks and the cut lines. So we'll turn off the print layer and this is what we're going to send to the laser. Okay, so we'll put the, our printed item into the machine. The position and the angle of the piece doesn't matter. We're going to use the camera system here to find the registration marks and it will automatically compensate for our uh, offset as well as our slant in the system. When making up our file, the cut lines are the standard RGB hairlines you would use for standard laser cutting. The registration marks are solid filled uh, RGB black dots, quarter inch in diameter, and there is a RGB black hairline on the outside as well. On our file we have a fairly high number of registration marks. This is required because they're fairly complex geometries. On simpler geometries you can get away with as few as three dots and still get very good results. Now that we've brought the job onto the plate, we can see the individual registration marks on screen and we can verify that they've been recognized by job control here under reg marks in our job properties. So when we hit start, the first thing the vision system will do is ask us to find the first registration mark, which is the one highlighted in orange in the top left of this image here. And then we move the cursor keys on the keypad to move the camera to that point. So we'll now move the, the black camera there above that point. And we'll see the, uh, the camera view up on the computer screen. In this case here, I hit it right on the dot without having to do much fine adjustment. We can also do some fine adjustment right here from the screen or using continuing to use the keypad if we want to. We hit OK and it will move on to find the second dot. If it is not too much angle on the piece, it will find it on its own. If it's outside of the camera view, then it might need some help to find that second dot. So right now it's going through and seeking to find each of the registration marks and it's going to compensate our cut pass accordingly for all of the different uh, distortions. Here's our final product here, perfectly contour cut, keychain, ready to go. Job Control Vision is really meant to speed up the registration process, so it's no longer a manual process, it's all automatic, which improves accuracy and reduces waste. Uh, it's good for acrylic, but it's also good for many other printable substrates, such as paper, cardstock, uh, even fabrics. Thanks for watching Tech's Corner. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below and please subscribe.